college campuses across the country are driving home the dangers of alcohol. News 4's Brian Shaw shows us how university police at Buffalo State College offered field tests today with beer goggles. Buffalo State College is continuing its ongoing education on the effects of alcohol with mock field sobriety tests to go along with its Do Your Part campaign. One of the things that we want students to be aware of is the personal responsibility that's involved in when you choose to be involved with alcohol, whether it's going to a party with a friend or if it's drinking yourself. University police offered beer goggles to students to simulate different alcohol levels. Rafael Garcia used the ones that were just at the legal limit of .08 and was asked to hold his leg up while counting. To be honest with you, I really could not keep my leg up because of the goggles. The simulation was just uh, real, you know. It's, uh, it, it gives you like that experience, and it's like f foggy and fuzzy inside those goggles, and it doesn't give you stability. So it was really hard to keep my leg up and to keep counting. Molly Mitchell used the next set, which simulated a blood alcohol level of 0.18. She did the heel to toe walk with them off and on to experience the difference, and believe that with them on, she was still walking in a straight line. That was really eye-opening, and especially if people are driving like that, like that's outrageous if you can't even be walking in any type of straight line or keeping your arms at your side. So people that are driving like that is just unbelievable. Raphael said that in the end, it's up to the individual and it's about self-control. It's not a level where you can where you can tell yourself, all right, this is where I stop. You know, you just, because once you start feeling it, maybe that's the point where you're just a little bit over the, the limit. So you just have to tell yourself, okay, I will only take two drinks, you know, or one drink. Students were then asked questions about alcohol and had the most difficulty with knowing how much they were consuming in each drink. For more information on a list of events, including a car simulator on Thursday, visit our website, WIVB.com. Brian Shaw, News 4 at 5.